two, three. subscribe if you get anything out of this um thank you to those of you who have already liked and subscribed if you want to contribute to the channel <laughs> i don't know what that involuntary hand movement was if you want to contribute to the channel go down to um the description box my amazon wish list link is down there and my email is down there if you want a personal reading you can just find it email me and i will get back to you with the details and god our angels and Ancestors, Ascended Masters, Beings of Light only. Welcome to this reading. Please give the Pisces Seer Collective the best and most accurate information for them at this time. Gratitude. Okay, so for this video, Spirit was like, oh, I was looking at this cup. This is what happened. All of this happened while I was doing a reading. I was doing a reading for myself, okay? And Spirit just started talking to me. They was like, they said, you're building an empire slash legacy. Trust the universe. They said, um, they're dreaming. They're having dreams about you. It said, they said the letter M and the color orange. And they said the color gold and tomatoes. So <laughs> that's four different videos. <laughs> this one is the letter M and the color orange because of my cup. So when I Googled the color orange, it said um, reddish orange and it said orange. So reddish orange is passion, desire, aggression, and domination. And orange is the fire of God, protection, something pleasant and fresh. So I decided to make the title, Your Life is Being Purified by the Power of God, because that's really what I got from that. Okay, also, I'm choosing a number, a rune, a song, and an I Ching. Okay, so here's your number. Uh, here's your rune. Here is your. I got little bowls over here. Okay. <laughs> here's your song. And. <laughs> so, um, five is the number of change. Um, you could have a five-year-old. You could be born on the fifth. You could be a life path five. <coughs> but God is about to bring some extraordinary change to your life. Some pleasant and fresh energy to you. Let's see. What room is this? This is Ansus. Odin, insight, communication, inspiration, true vision. So you have like this true vision and you've been inspired to do something with it. You have a special insight, a special communication with spirit. So you should utilize it because it's amazing. Listen to them. They know what you're supposed to be doing. Okay. <laughs> Let's see, what is the song? The song is Best Mistake by Ariana Grande. Wow, in that song she says, the best things in life are already mine. <laughs> Hold up, I need to see the lyrics so I can tell y'all what they talking about. She say, I already got a good thing with me. And I already got everything I need. The best things in life are already mine. Hold up. I found the song, but now I'm finna just pause it and read the lyrics to y'all because I don't know why. Every time I push record, it's like my nose starts running. 
it says, how soon do we forget how we felt dealing with emotions that never left, playing with the hand that we were dealt? In this game, maybe I'm the sinner and you're the saint. Gotta stop pretending what we ain't. Why we pointing fingers anyway when we're the same? Break up, make up, total waste of time. Can we please make up our minds and stop acting like we're blind? Wow. <laughs> Okay, let's see what these archings say. It says, you know, I'll be saving my love for you. Because you're the best mistake I've ever made. And this is facts, okay? And that's what that fucking reddish-orange energy is about. It is about the passion and desire that you had for someone. And the aggression and domination they tried to give you in return. Okay? This is Khan. This is the I Ching Khan the 29th I change okay it says the abysmal water which is emotions I think water is emotions okay if you are sincere you have success in your heart and whatever you do succeeds so you were sincere in any connections that you have had thus far and um I don't know what my nose okay um, you've been just running into a lot of energies that don't really care to be sincere. This is the 39th um, I Ching. It's Qian Obstruction. Obstruction, the Southwest. I heard obstruction of justice. So <laughs> it's karma. Okay. Karma's going on. This person is on trial spiritually. Obstruction, the southwest furthers, the northeast does not further one to see the great man. Perseverance, good fortune. Um, honestly, that's what I really got from that. Obstruction of justice. There's an obstruction of justice popping. And you might like fortune cookies. I was just going to say, that was some fortune cookie shit. <laughs> But I got a lot of that with the I Ching's. I mean, obviously, because they're Chinese. And I mean, I don't know. It just depends on how you look it up. And I always intuitively write down whatever spirit wants me to write. I'm looking over here trying to figure out which deck I want to use, even though I have, like, a gang of decks over here. Okay. So, yeah, fill up your cup with sacred giggles. That's what you're about to do. The spirit is about to fill your cup up. So you better befriend the word polarize. Well, because you have befriended the word polarize, okay? Yeah, you have been manifesting, my love. You are a creator. You could be an air sign. But you just make shit appear out of thin air. You also could be an earth sign. <laughs> and you're very really connected in with earth right now. Wow. You could be an earth <laughs> creator water came out um you should work with water whatever you do um we got the good kind okay and we got the edge of evolution feels messy in reverse so um this is about to be fast it's not about to feel messy at all <laughs> it's about to be very clean very quick very precise the karma and the rewards because you have chosen to become a being that um, does the best that you could do, okay? You wrote a mission statement for your soul. Meaning you chose. You chose spirit. You chose the light. You are a divine, of a divine lineage. And now it's time for you to rise because you are the phoenix. These people burnt you down they didn't want you to be in flow with your money and they never thought that you would cozy up with risk like they never thought that you would take a chance and step out the way you're about to step out <laughs> this fell out okay and i'm leaving it out it says ambush your fear with um your ferocious dreams so you might still have like you know some residual fear going on afraid that you're gonna still run into the same thing but god is purifying your life with his fire okay like there's nothing you should comment that god is purifying my life with his fire now the now right now that's happening right now already as we speak so go ahead and start celebrating your wins because and make sure you show gratitude again again and again and just keep follow through fail so maybe you're not following through
important. Okay. Um, whoever hurt you could have been an air sign. <laughs> Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I don't know why I giggled. <laughs> but because earth, air, and water came out. But um, yeah, so there's a need for you to be brazen. Be bold right now with your choices. Speak up. Speak for yourself. You know, and speak over the injustice of others because you're healed from this you're out of this state of Greece of Greece what you might like Greece and now I'm hearing Greece lightning go <laughs> Greece lightning <laughs> okay also you could be um, of Greek descent you could be from Greece which somehow reminds me about the angel rays but I'm gonna get to those in a second <laughs> because I'm letting the channel So you've been totally naked with spirit. And now it's time for you to get back to the elements. Okay. To allow a burst of color to come into your life. And you're not kind of, it's like you feel like you're not getting any emotional pleasure from this life. Like it's all been filled with strife, with negativity, with people wearing masks, pretending to be something that they are not pretending to be the good kind of people and honestly at a soul level there's still some forgiveness that um, is holding you back from leveling up you need to forgive yourself and you need to forgive others because you're in balance I don't understand what the issue is there's just some sort of slight resistance and this is card number 22 So I have, I have those um, things. Yeah, yeah. Like you don't feel free, but you are totally free. You're totally free. And those people, they're not gonna, they're not experiencing this rebirth, this upgrade, this purification that you're about to go through. Like you're about to really, really be very happy. Okay, <laughs> that's all I can say. So it says, 22 is a, mas a, a master number that carries additional power. Um, angels are with you and offering you the strongest support. The Holy Spirit wants you to find ways of living your life in peace and harmony with yourself and with others. Love, relationships, partnerships, balance, and spirituality. Love reigns among the people who possess this number. So, you got love, my boo. My boo boo. My love. Oh, sure. And not only that, you have so much shit encoded in your DNA that you're coming into. Well, that you could be coming into if you would just go ahead and stop playing and just let yourself because you're full of riches already. You already have it. You should say, every day you should say, everything I desire is on its way because everything I desire is already mine, okay? You need to realize that you're royal and that you're rich. <laughs> every day you need to remind yourself that you live in abundance because that's literally one of your biggest blocks is that you don't believe it is that you're having a hard time going with the flow yeah and you're not giving yourself enough self-love you're too worried about the people in the mass coming back and you're not honing in on what it is that you really need when you really need it in the moment and if you don't handle this it's going to affect it's going to start to affect your foundation like the only one thing that you really need to worry about is what are your intentions, period. Which kind of gives me, which, and I heard like revenge, like it's like you want vengeance, but you don't need vengeance. Oh, also, 
with the color M. I got your name could be Maggie, Michael. Uh, what did I write? Miriam. These are things that I heard. <laughs> did I say Mary? Miguel. Um, Mark. <laughs> Yeah, you need to recharge. You're recharging your destiny. That's what you're doing, okay? Not that it ever died or anything like that, but you went through a very, very radical rebirth, okay? You went through a lot of bullshit, and you realized that you were filled with things you didn't even need. You didn't need the things you were filled with, and so you got curious and started expanding into wonder, okay? You woke up, <laughs> and so now it's time for you to give yourself a different kind of love and to feel in order to know instead of just going in with this like I don't know it's like some sort of like attitude I almost want to say like you're just like kind of pissy because I mean I'm sorry I'm, I'm not trying to get on here or anything like that but I'm not saying it to like pick at you what I'm saying is like you don't really see like it said what did it say it said aggression and domination like you're it says you're getting stuck on the things that people are saying about you because it says loose jaws okay loose jaws make killing with teeth difficult kill with claws arms and legs or scavenge carcasses you just need to find your people okay this is the time for the great gathering like you honestly do not have time to fucking squander right now like right now it's time to focus on your goals focus on your dreams okay you're an original light worker you don't even have shit to worry about you more worried about making people want to see you again or that person is over there doing black magic making trying to make you want to see them again because you live in abundance your family is fake they're um doing all sorts of ninja life hacks and hacking your shit and all up in your business okay and god has given each and every one of these people a chance to choose to do the right thing see it says god spares all things because um they are his and his breath is in everything. God sees everything, hence no man can utter injustice. I mean injustice and not be found. Didn't I say they have obstructed justice trying to fuck with you? And you think that this is the Chronicles of Narnia. You know what I'm saying? Like it's just going to go on and on and on. But these people are already fucking inmates. They already in jail because of these fucking ninja life hacks they was trying to do to you. They in jail and they finna start fucking selling each other out. <laughs> because they believed everything that they heard. They never came to the source. These people that have been talking about you behind your back with these loose ass jaws. They never came to your face and asked you about anything that you needed or anything that you wanted. These people are like alcoholics. I don't know why I'm talking about these people. But this, okay, I do. I'm sorry. It came to me just as soon as I said that. Because these are the things that God is purifying your life of. That the fire of God is going to rush over. Okay? It has already begun. It says wine could lead minds astray and cause all sorts of problems. It says twisted lies. <sighs> these people been telling you all sorts. They've been lying about every fucking thing. Trying to steal your inheritance. And expecting you to give them some money. After they fucking stole from you and misjudged you every chance that they got. These bitches are slow horses on the terminal list. And you are old ass old. This ain't your first time fighting these fucking people. You have amazing abilities. Here go these goddamn three skeletons. <laughs> Here go these goddamn three skeletons that was discovered in Arizona. That keeps on coming out. But you are true blood. You have true blood. There's true your there's true divinity just running through your veins. Okay? You are a fucking heart stopper. You are the most mixed up non-delinquent on the block. You don't even be involved in this shit. You don't even give a fuck about what they're talking about. You don't even care. You could care less. All they got to offer is some ugly ass love. And then want to talk about, uh, want to measure 
they don't they're not measuring shit in love like you do like you're like I get the feeling that you're like you know whatever you give me I give you pretty much you're a sharer sharing is caring for you <laughs> you're like me you're like you know if I'm smoking y'all smoking I'm always being honest like but God I want you to know that these people have told you the last fucking lies they're gonna they're gonna be able to get away with I don't know what I don't know when this happened <laughs>
<laughs> ain't nothing you could do about it. Romantic connection, which I got when I said, um, may the God who dwells in heaven help you both on your way and may his angels accompany you both. So you're, like I said, it's the great gathering. God is purifying your life to make room. Now, now we finna talk about <laughs> what we make it room for. We're making room for romance and connection. We're making room for joy and so you need to pray more and make sure you're, you're asking spirit for what you want. Take a step back from people is what you really need to do. And you need to clear, cancel, and release those ugly thoughts that you're having, okay? Blessings and abundance is all that's coming to you. That's it. Everything else c- can only get through to you because you're in your mind about it thinking it can get through. Trust me, I am guilty as charged. I do too. But... Keep your vibration high. Like, I want to give myself a little bit of time to be a brat now. (laughs) You know? And I really try to have true compassion for others. Like, because with this wisdom comes a lot of knowledge. Like, a lot of things that you find out. A lot of connections that you start to make. And you really start to pity these fucking people. Because all they ever had to do was Google or pick up a book like you did that's it that's all they had to do was google something and they would have found a way to accept themselves but now you get to accept yourself and it's very important that you do because there ain't nothing coming into you but intuitions and downloads (laughs) about your success but everything happens in divine time Right now, all you need to do is cut the cords with peace and love, okay? And meditate more. Listen deeply. Pray. Make sure you're talking to spirit. Make sure that um, you're keeping your power in check. That you're wishing only the best for people. Because that's how they got in. That's how they got to be an inmate. You don't want to be an inmate too, wishing the worst on someone. Excuse me. Okay. Is there more? I feel like there's more. So, all of this shit is about to be a mystery to these people because your angel, angel guides are keeping everything a secret. Like, you don't even know what's going to happen. You don't even know what is going to go on, but they are going to bless you so hard. Sexuality. So, you might be coming into like this more sexy spirituality that makes you feel very like sexually free okay <laughs> but I don't get the feeling that you are here being all promiscuous okay but you don't you gonna get so lucky you finna start winning shit you finna start just attracting the best people ever because you have ambition about you have ambition in spirituality you strive to grow always and you operate from an energy pour love into yourself first and be very versatile and open-minded and in the way that you use your power because you have great power that god blessed you with be powerful as well <laughs> but you need to trust your instincts and stop questioning yourself you might like to listen to big lotto or uh beyonce or aliyah or salt and pepper but yeah you need to break these superstitions that you got going on in your mind. These little, like, um, conspiracies that you're kind of making up. Like, like I say, again, I'm guilty of it, too. Like, sometimes you really just don't know. Like, I mean, I would say, <laughs> I'm just going to say that things used to get very quiet and I would not know nothing that was going on. It didn't matter how much divination I did. <laughs> I could not do nothing but healing. And that might be where you are right now. It's not a place where all you need to do is just heal. That's it. And let God do the purifying of your life. Focus on you. Focus on your dreams. Focus on your goals. Watch that video that I posted first. So it was like, it's one of the four videos that I'm posting today. It says, um, oh, I, I read it to you too. You're building an empire. Trust the universe. Okay. And also, you might want to watch all four of them. (laughs) Because I read all four titles to you for some reason. And I'm shuffling the deck. So you also need to change your perception, your perspective on things. You need to see from a higher perspective. Always, you should always be operating in your higher energy. The higher your vibration is, the easier it is for you to bend this reality to your will. 
swear time be flying when I be doing this and I love that because that means I'm having so much fun doing what I love to do I love to do this y'all y'all don't know okay so um there are seven colors of light rays okay the medic's physical system of angel colors is based on seven different light rays which loosely correspond to sunlight or a rainbow's colors which is why rainbows are so significant well part of the reason um there's blue yellow pink white green red and purple but for some reason green isn't highlighted okay um green wasn't highlighted <laughs> which makes me say um heart chakra do some heart chakra work listen to some um heart chakra sound bowls um start saying the things you love out loud those are good affirmations you know i love candy i love reading i love um sex i don't know maybe you love sex <laughs> Y'all nasty. Y'all so freak nasty. So it's okay. Okay. So blue is Archangel Michael's colors. Okay. Blue is the color of Archangel Michael. That's his ray. Archangel Michael is the blue ray. I don't know why I keep saying that. Maybe Archangel Michael guides you. Um, leader of all the holy angels. That's Archangel Michael's place and protector of all, of us all. Okay. Yellow, Jophiel. The angel of beautiful thoughts. Pink, Shamiel, the angel of peaceful relationships. White, Gabriel, the angel of revelation. Green, Raphael, the angel of healing. Red, Uriel, the angel of wisdom. And purple, Zadkiel, the angel of mercy. And I'm really getting the feeling that they had me read this to tell you that these are the blessings that are coming to you, okay? You know, um, Archangel Michael is going to provide you with guidance. All these angels will guide you, of course. But Archangel Michael is going to be one of your lead guides, okay? Beautiful thoughts, more peaceful relationships, more revelations of the things that people have been doing to you. Um, what else? I don't want to run out of time. Uh, more healing, more wisdom, more mercy, okay? And <laughs> with that, have a wonderful day, okay? I'll see you later.